Hello, my friend. Which was a pity, because Hermione, the cleverest witch in Harry's year, had muggle parents, knew perfectly well how to use a telephone, and would probably... Copy, copy. Hermione Granger hadn't been in touch either. What the heck is this? I.E. Namichi. Raccoon. Or that time. Hello, my friend. Hey, what the heck is this? Potomac. Pitawamak. Tomahawk. Tomahawk. Which was a pity, because Hermione, the cleverest witch in Harry's year, had muggle parents, knew perfectly well how to use a telephone, and would probably... Copy, copy. Raccoon. Just the beginning of... We're tracking... Hey, what the heck is... Hello, my friend. Hello, my friend. Come on. Which was a pity, because Hermione, the cleverest witch, Hermione Granger, hadn't been in touch either. Rated Ace is helping to explore the new It's the planet I'm a member of the world's largest interest group. We're tracking human kinds. When I walked on Earth's solar society, we're building other worlds. We're tracking the world. This is for life on a human society. I'm a member of the moon, Earth, near asteroids and comets. That's why planetary kinds venture in the system. Let us purge the new party. To get most of my memory back. Let us encourage the dark races so they'll be lenient when they take over. Rated base helping to explore and do it. Buzz Aldrin. I'm a member of the world's largest interest group. We're tracking two human kinds. When I walked on Earth's solar society, I knew it was a moon Mars. We're building other worlds. We're tracking the reports. This is for life on a human society. I'm a member of the moon Earth near asteroids and comets. That's why planetary kinds venture in the Hello, my friend. Let us give a Canada Council The years of development. One of the things I loved about that Apollo decontamination period where they put the astronauts on the Mars Exploration Rover spacecraft was Richard Nixon in the, uh, on the aircraft carriers, hundreds if not thousands of tests and design refinements, landings, mines, and scores of engineers at JPL and elsewhere. Hello, my brothers, 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 my
Let us put them on very quickly. We are breaking news now from Skagit County, where three oil refinery workers were rushed to the hospital after a chemical leak. Officials at the Tesoro Oil Refinery in Anacortes say a small amount of toxic chemicals spilled from a processing unit. It was quickly contained. I have to go down to a cellar. Mr. particular group. have you any idea how much damage this bulldozer would suffer if I just let it go straight over? What it has to do with is a new world order agenda. We just learned at least one of the workers has already been released from the hospital. We also received a lot of calls tonight about flames at the refinery, but we're told it was just a ground flare that burns excess gas intentionally. I had no ability to question or to reason. I could only do exactly what I was told to do. One thing that I was told to do was to attend a White House cocktail party. This was during the Reagan-Bush administration while Ronald Reagan was president. It was on, this one, eight, on one seven. occasion in particular that I heard Ronald Reagan talking with then Prime Minister of Canada, Canada Brian Mulroney, who was also involved in this new morning. order. Crews will close one northbound lane on I-405 in Kirkland between Northeast 85th Street and Northeast 116th Street. Control of the masses. This is terrifying in proportion, especially when... Having experienced mind control, I know that there's no peace. Building a new wall to keep out noise. Drivers should expect delays Without beginning at 6 a.m. So there's so no so free so will. Yeah. Without God-given free will, there's no spiritual expression. And I wonder Society. what kind of a so-called world peace can we have where people have no peace of mind, where they have no spiritual expression, when they have no, when they're not even in touch with their own identity or. It's, it's very frightening in proportion when we consider the ramifications of what all mind control entails and how anyone can justify a robotic society.